Hey guys, this is just going to be a quick video on how to make a two sensor line follower using two high technic color sensors. Now I already have a tutorial that teaches you how to build this program and it's a two sensor line follower with two EV3 color sensors. And since I already have that tutorial, if you haven't seen that, go see that right now so you can make this program because this tutorial is not going to tell you how to make this program, just how to adapt it for high technic color sensors. So anyway. The first thing we're going to do is take out our high technicolor sensor block right here. We need to set it to RGB. And then what we're going to do is going to data operations, go to compare, and then whenever this comes out, and then we see right here we have less than or equal to 10 for our color sensor here. So that's what we're going to do in the same thing here. Less than or equal to, and then for B we're going to type into 10 because High Tactic doesn't have a switch block for their color sensor, so we're going to have to do our own switching mechanism ourselves. So now that we have this set up, what we can do is plug the white function tab, whatever it is, in, in for A, and then we're going to take this and we're going to change it to logic, and then this equals is going to go into here. And now what we're doing is where we have the high technic color sensors light value being red that's what the white is it checks to see if it's less than or equal to 10 which means it's on the black line you're going to have to adjust this 10 yourself that's just what I'm using for example and then it goes here and this is if yes and then this is if no and now we're going to just do this for the same thing on the bottom uh, whenever this comes up alright so we've got high technic color sensor block and then our compare block Next, what we're going to do is we're going to set the uh, color sensor to the appropriate mode, RGB. And then we're going to set this to less than or equal to, and then 10, just like it is over here. So B is going to be 10. Then we're going to plug the white tab into A. We're going to set this to logic. And then this equals is going to get plugged into this logic switch. And there you have it. This is the two sensor line following program adapted to work with two high technic color sensors as opposed to two EV3 sensors. So thank you for watching. I hope you find this helpful and subscribe for more EV3 tutorials. Bye.